All right, y'all, this is crazy. So Drake just dropped his new song, and now right after that, Kendrick just dropped. It's Meet the Gram, so let's check this one out as well. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father. Let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man. Your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa were a world condom. That's I'm crazy. sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind him. Life is hard, I know. But you All right, so me personally, like, if you're going at each other, that's cool. But, like, don't bring kids into it, you know what I mean? Because they have nothing to do with it. So just leave the kids out. And it just always go beat us home Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown And you're a good kid that need good leadership Let me be your mentor Since your That's daddy crazy. don't teach you shit Never let a man piss on your leg, son Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son Never fall in the escort business That's bad religion Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got women. bitches Never cold switch, whether right or wrong You're a black man, even if it don't benefit your goals Do some push-ups how he going all right so that's one thing so how's he making fun of drake for being mixed and then adonis is even more racially ambiguous than drake and he's saying he's a black man get some discipline don't cut them corners like your daddy did fuck what ozempic did don't pay to play with them brazilians get a gym membership understand no throwing rocks and hiding hands that's law don't be ashamed about who you with that's how he treats your moms don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again be sure Five percent will comprehend, but ninety-five is lost. Be proud of who you are. Your strength come from within. A lot of superstars that's real, but your daddy ain't one of them, and you nothing like him. You. I mean, he is a superstar. I mean, there's no denying that. But I do like the song. You know, what I mean, Kendrick's talking, but it's like less. Uh, it's not like upbeat. I mean, he's talking though. Carry yourself as king. Can't understand me right now. Just play this when you're eighteen. Dear Sandra, your son got some habits. I hope you don't undermine them, especially with. All right, so it looks like he's kind of like uh, addressing the different people in Drake's family. Like he addressed Adonis. Now he's addressing Sandra, Drake's mom. So let's see what he has to say about to her. All the girls that's hurt inside this climate. You a woman, so you know how it feels to be in alignment with emotions, hoping the man can see you and not be blinded. Dear Dennis, you gave birth to a master manipulator. Even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor. I think you should ask for more paper and more paper and more, uh, more paper. I'm blaming you for all his gambling addictions, psychopath intuition, the man that like to play victim. You raised a horrible fucking person. The nerve of you, Dennis. Sandra, sit down. What I'm about to say is Bro, hearing this, it makes me like wonder what happened between them. You know, cause like you got this from one side, this from the other side. Like they're both throwing shots at each other. But like what really happened? Like y'all think we'll ever find out? Heavy, now listen. <clears throat> Your son's a sick man with sick thoughts. I think niggas like him should die. Him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest of their life. He hates black women, hypersexualize them with kinks of a nympho fetish. Grew facial hair because he understood being the beard just fit him better. Huh. He got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on a monthly allowance. And a child should never mm. be compromised and he keeping his child around him. And we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking. Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose. I've been in this industry. So like we just listened to uh, Drake's song. Now listen to Kendrick's. So Drake, uh, Kendrick said something about sex offenders and all this to Drake. Drake was saying that Kendrick hits women. So hey, my hands are clean. 12 years, I'ma tell y'all one little secret. It's some weird shit going on, and some of these artists be here to police it. They be streamlining victims all inside of their home and calling them tender. Then leak videos, set themselves to further push their agendas. To any woman that be playing this music, know that you're playing your sister. Or better yet, selling your niece to the weirdos, not the good ones. Cat Williams, I gave you the truth, so I'ma get mine. The embassy about to get ready too. It's only a matter of time. Mm. Hey, Lil Bron, keep the family away. Hey, Curry, keep the family away. To anybody that embody the love for their kids, keep the family away they looking at you too if you standing by him keep the family away i'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives keep the family safe hey kendrick throwing some shots now i can't lie kendrick is throwing some shots a bunch of whole bunch of allegations same with drake sending a whole lot of shots empty in the clip a whole lot of allegations hey what's true let me know what do y'all think is true drop a comment let me know what y'all think real is really going on
Dear baby girl, I'm sorry that your father not active inside your world. He don't commit to much but his music, yeah, that's for sure. He a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs. Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own. Should be teaching you timetables or watching... So from what I see, he does do a lot with his family. He always has his son, Adonis, always with his dad, mom. So I don't know about that part, but uh, let's go. Frozen with you, or at your 11th birthday, singing poems with you. Instead, he being Turks, paying for sex and popping perks, examples that you don't deserve. I want to tell you that you're loved, you're brave, you're kind. You got a gift to change the world and can change your father's mind. Because our children is the future, but he lives inside confusion. Money's always been illusion, but that's the life he's used to. His father probably didn't claim him neither. History do repeats itself. Sometimes it don't need a reason. Damn, but how would like Damn to Dennis, what's going on? That he's Hiding another child, give him grace. This the reason I made Hiding another child? He all think he got a child with if he does. Like after what happened with Adonis, I don't think he would hide another child. I mean, especially if he's in a beef with Kendrick, like the set last time with um story of Adadon. He I guess he don't want nothing like that to happen again. So if he did have another child, probably would have seen him by now or her. Mr. Morale, so our babies like you can cope later. Give you some confidence to go through something. It's hope later. I never want to hear you chasing man because it's felt behavior. Sitting in the club with sugar daddies for validation. You need to know that love is eternity and trumps all pain. I tell you who your father is, just play this song when it rains. Yes, he's a hit maker, songwriter, superstar, right? And a fucking dead beat that should never say <laughs> more life. Meet the ground. <laughs> That's crazy. What's with these long ass songs, bruh? Get it, make it to the point. Make multiple versions if you need to. I wanted to crash a party, but truthfully, I don't have a hating bone in my body. It's supposed to be a good exhibition within the game, but you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name. Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people? Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you. And I like to understand, cause your house was never a home. 37, but you showing up as a seven year old. You got gambling problems, drinking problems, pill popping, and spending problems. Problems, bad with money, poor house, soliciting women problems. Therapy's a lovely start, but I suggest some ayahuasca. Strip the ego from the bottom. I try to empathize with you, cause I know that you ain't been through nothing. Crave entitlement, but wanna be like so bad that it's- All right, so the title's making sense now. So it's called Meet the Grams, and he's going through the entire Graham family. I guess just addressing each person in Drake's family about him, who he is as a person, what he does, and all this stuff. Puzzling, no dominance. Let's recap moments when you didn't fit in. No secret handshakes with your friend. No culture cachet to binge. Just disrespecting your mother. Identities on the fence. Don't know which family would love you. The skin that you living in is compromised and personas can't channel your masculine. Even when standing next to a woman, you a body shamer. You go hide them baby mamas, ain't you? You embarrassed of them. That's not right. Mm. That ain't how mama raised us. Take that mask off. I want to see what's under them achievements. Why well, believe you? You never gave us nothing to believe in because you lied about religious views you lied about your surgery you lied about your accent and your past tense all is perjury you lied about your ghost riders you lied about your crew members that y'all pussy you lied on them I know hey Kendrick's getting off a lot of stuff in this I mean I could see why they're six minutes long like Drake's was like over seven minutes long but it's like golly like keep the three minutes Cause I mean I can see some people losing like interest, like not paying attention, because everybody now has a short attention span. Uh, attention span, but like, even if you have to do part one, part two, like, chop it up, you know? Cause like, but Kendrick, he's saying a whole lot. No, they all got you in them. You lied about your son. You lied about your daughter, huh? You lied about His the daughter. other kids that's out there hoping that you come. You lied about the only artist that can offer you some help. Fuck a rap battle. This a long life battle with yourself. Mm. Hey, man. What y'all think about that? Drake dropped, Kendrick dropped immediately after. No time wasted. He fired back immediately. Both of them talking a lot of shit, saying a lot of stuff about each other. Hey, who who do y'all think had the best song? You know, let me know. Let me know what y'all think. All right, so, hey, if you enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Hey, and I'll see y'all in the next one.